Hi there, and welcome to the Crux Supplier Spotlight. My name is Dan Ostermuller, and I'm, I'm the Head of Supplier Relations at Crux Informatics. Joining me today is Brooks McFeely, the CEO of MT Newswires, uh, to speak a bit about his company as product. So Brooks, why don't you introduce yourself uh, and MT Newswires? Great, thanks, Dan. Uh, great to be here. Uh, Brooks McFeely, I'm the founder and CEO of MT Newswires. So we've been around for about 21 years. We're a global, real-time, multi-asset class financial news service. Uh, we have reporters in roughly 18 different countries around the globe producing coverage of uh, capital markets, economies, precious metal, energies, uh, energy commodities rather, um, really the vast majority of asset classes that uh, are tradable. And um, we provide that news as a feed solution. Uh, we power most of the largest bank, brokerage, retail, trading, uh, wealth management um, uh, applications in North America and a growing number in, in Europe and Asia. Um, our coverage is focused on North America, uh, Europe, and, and the vast majority of uh, economies and markets in Asia Pacific. Great. That obviously covers quite a bit, both in terms of uh, uh, regional coverage as well as uh, potential use cases. So, you know, at a, at a high level, and if, if there's any specific examples you want to cite, you know, what is unique about your offering and, and the products uh, in your portfolio? Right. So we, there's a number of things that we do, which are, you know, very unique in the sense, uh, you know, both from our, our global perspective, we're really uh, one of the few, if only services that provides a, a one-stop shop for global financial news covering, uh, you know, most of the relevant and liquid public companies, uh, again, trading across all the regions that we talked about in, in Asia uh, Pacific, for instance, we cover 15 countries. So all of the exchanges and public companies there, we cover the economic news and events that transpire in those countries. Also uh, the major currencies globally. Um, and you know all the the commodities like uh, you know oil and natural gas and uh, and other um, you know issues which affect those economies and business in those regions. Um, we're we're a as I mentioned a feed solution, so our clients can uh, can license our news and and each story is ticker tagged and category coded. Uh, we use up to 160 different topic codes, uh, so our clients can uh, build the experiences on their platforms for their customers. So Brooks, obviously there's a lot of different types of, of use cases with news. Can you speak a little bit to uh, the different types of clients you have and the different segments that you serve? Right, so we serve really every segment of financial services from retail brokerage to wealth management, uh, buy and sell side, as well as the HFT, Quant and, and Algo communities. Um, so we really you know, kind of work with the vast majority of, uh, of use cases in financial services where you know, providing clients and customers with real-time, actionable, global financial news is, you know, is, is a requirement and a, and a need. Um, so we really, you know, we really kind of touch, touch every, uh, you know, every part of financial services. Well, you probably can say this about any time in history, but there seems to be a lot of news that's been generated over the past year, and a lot of us are, are checking uh, what's going on each and every day as uh, things start to, to reopen. You know, what have you learned both in terms of how you've operated as a business, as well as you know the, the actual news itself that that's come through your platform over the past year, and uh, you know where do you see think where do you see things going going forward? Yeah, that's a great question. We fortunately um, were were sort of. Uh, set up for COVID before before COVID made working remote popular. So our newsroom is, has always been uh, global. Uh, so we have, as I mentioned, reporters in uh, roughly 18 different countries. Um, so we've been a remote and redundant uh, news organization. We have, you know, headquarters offices. But other than that, you know, we try and find the best reporters and editors, journalists and, and economists no matter where they reside. Um, so, you know, no, no major adjustments for us. Fortunately, capital markets have been strong globally throughout COVID and obviously in, the, in this uh, phase of economic recovery, the demand for our information uh, has grown significantly, not only uh, here in, in the US and, and North America, but in Asia, uh, there's tremendous demand for uh, local as well as global financial information as the securities markets have become more popular Got it. Uh, well, last but not least, you know, what are you looking forward uh, to uh, achieve with uh, with Crux? 
Well, I think Crux is a valuable partner of ours and and making our services available on platforms that we uh, that we haven't uh, either considered or reached uh, in the past. So uh, you know, Snowflake and AWS Marketplace are two new uh, dissemination platforms and and uh, listings uh, that we didn't you know that we didn't have. And so you know, by going through Crux, we're able to deliver. Um, one get exposure to the um, to those uh, segments and customers that tend to use those uh, delivery platforms to look for news and, and data, um, and so it's been a great you know um, a great relationship in helping us get to those you know those platforms and, and others I'm sure in the future. Great. Well, we look forward to working with you going forward, Brooks. Thanks for the time. Uh, and if anybody uh, watching is interested in learning more about MT News Wires and particularly taking MT News Wires data via Crux, uh, please feel free to, to get in touch. And uh, we look forward to, to working with all of you in the future. Thank you. Thanks for having me, Dan. Appreciate it. Take care.